What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak the new iOS 10.1.1 and uh, in this example I'm using my iPhone 5 uh, but it works uh, just as well with 64-bit devices so it's a software exploit so it works with any device running iOS 10.1.1 uh, as you can see, I'm not jailbroken yet, and um, I am running iOS 10.1.1, build number 14B150. Now, what you need to do is simply start your Safari browser and go to this address here taiji10.mobile and here you will get an explanation how it works they will tell you that you can't install Cydia on a device that is not jailbroken but you can of course install apps that Apple has approved regular apps now the Taiji team has found a smart way to hide Cydia and the jailbreak inside of approved applications so the result is that you get an approved application that has Cydia and the jailbreak hidden inside of it. Um, so what you need to do is simply go to this address taiji10.mobile and then at the bottom click on this icon here and now you will get to the App Store with the free injected apps. Now all of these apps are of course 100% free and they are all injected with uh, Cydia so it doesn't matter which app you pick. Uh, sometimes the apps get patched though, so if the first app doesn't work then uh, simply try uh, another app. Um, they are of course all 100% free. Um, is it responding? Install, please. Oh, come on. I don't know what the hell is doing. It's doing right now. Can we install it, please? I don't know what the heck is up with that one. Uh, let's try another app. Let's just start over. I don't know what's going on here. There we go. I have no idea why it did that. But it doesn't matter. Uh, hopefully this app works, but uh, sometimes, like I said, you need to try a couple of apps before it works, because sometimes the apps get patched. And once this app is downloaded uh, and installed, you simply need to start it up and keep it running for about 30 seconds. Because when you start this app, then Cydia and the jailbreak will start in the background. And if you wonder about the noise, then it's my cat who is dying to help me do my jailbreak videos. <sighs> what would I do without him? Uh, I don't know 
what what the hell it's doing right now. Um, anyway, like I said, um, all of the apps are free, of course, and all of them are injected with Cydia, but sometimes they get patched, so if the first app doesn't work, then try the, uh, try the next one. And uh, like I said, when I'm starting, when I start this app now, then Cydia and Jailbreak will start in the background. So I need to start the app and wait for about 30 seconds, so the Jailbreak and Cydia has time to install in the background. There we go. And now we simply need to keep the app running for about 30 seconds. No, thank you. And right now, the uh, Cydia and Jailbreak is being installed in the background. And uh, I think they should do it. Now we're simply going to restart our devices. Just hit the power, power button and keep it pressed. And turn off your device. Uh, and now when we restart our device, we will see uh, uh, quite soon if the jailbreak worked or not. Uh, if this app did, doesn't work, then I will simply try the next app, but usually it works right away. We shall see. Yep, the app worked, and now it's just finishing off the jailbreak and uh, installing Cydia. It does take a little while to jailbreak, but... Um, uh, Compared to other jailbreaks, uh, this is only jailbreak 5 or 10, but compared to the previous jailbreaks, this is still a rather fast jailbreak. Um, it takes about like, 6 or 7 minutes or so to uh, jailbreak your device. So all considered, this is actually the fastest way to jailbreak. Uh, should be done soon and when it's finished jailbreaking and booting up then we should be jailbroken fully untethered on iOS 10.1.1 Taiji 10.mobile There's Cydia. There's the app that we installed, with the, the Cydia injected app. And there's Cydia. I'm just going to show you real quickly that I am on uh, iOS 10.1.1. And then I'm going to start Cydia and uh, show you that it's working. Uh, iOS 10.1.1. And now I'm going to start Cydia to show you that it's working. And. Uh, As you can see on the bottom here too, uh, iOS 10.1.1. And it's working just the way it's supposed to. So there you have it. And that's how easy it is to jailbreak the new iOS 10.1.1. And if you liked my video, then I would be very happy if you commented, rated, and subscribed.
Thank you for watching and have a great day.